Hi guys, welcome to Book of Shayla and welcome to August 1st, which means it is 31 days of cut files. Now, I don't know that I will have a process video for all 31 days, but I will do as many as I can. So, in case you don't know, let me start from the beginning. 31 Days of Cut Files is put on by Janet Fritz and MK Gunn. Janet Fritz is Galaxy Girl Creations and MK Gunn is Some Assemblage Required. They design some cut files and you can buy them and you get 31 of them. You can buy them digitally and print and cut them yourself or you can buy them pre-cut, which is what I do because I have like one of the first generations of crickets that you still have to put the cartridge and stuff in. So I have no way of cutting them myself. So I buy them pre-cut. Then throughout August, you get this little calendar with your cut files and it tells you which one they're going to be working with every day. Week one and week five were designed by Janet Fritz and weeks two, three, and four were designed by MK Gunn. So I've done this, I think this is my third year that I've done it. Now, um, used to, they would have different companies, like one week would be pear tree cut files, one week would be whatever, I can't even remember them all. But this year, I think this is the first year that they're all done by Janet and MK. So, what is today's cut file? Today's cut file is this cool little sign. Here, let me put it down here. Hopefully you can see it. Yep, this says adults only. You, when you get them pre-cut, they all they come all in white. I took, and it apparently is not completely dry, even though I did it last night. I sprayed it with Heidi Swap Color Shine in black. So I'm leaving little black spots where I have had it. <clears throat> Excuse me. But it'll be all right. So this was my inspiration. So if you've been on my um, channel, you know that I something always sparks inspiration. And I've been doing a whole series about making page kits using different things for inspiration. So this was my inspiration. I knew I had to use it, right? Because I'm doing 31 days of cut files. So I thought, what could adults only be? What could what picture could I use? Um, my mom and brother-in-law and sister-in-law and I have season tickets to the Broadway touring companies that come to Oklahoma City. And this year they redid the theater and have this really cool bar now and so this year they have drinks for every show that kind of go along with the show so these were our drinks from wicked i'm gonna have to go back and look up what they're called because i don't remember but these are our drinks from wicked and so they're adult only drinks so i thought they would be perfect then so this was the second step then i was like okay i need some a jumping off point, something to get me started. So I went through my sketches and I found this sketch from Paper Issues from May 15th. And I was like, okay, one picture. The viewfinder can kind of be my cut file. This'll work. So I was like, you know what? I have an entire paper pad of Vicki Booten pre-made uh, mixed media that I've used like one piece out of, maybe two. I am going to do that. Someone, a couple of 30 days of sketches series ago, uh, did that. They like took the sketches and they went through the Vicky Booten paper pads and pulled a paper that kind of went with them. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do that. So I went to my paper pad and I found this one that these circles are gonna represent the flowers. So that was the second step. Then I have bought the entire, all four ephemera packs from Vicky Booten's mixed media line. So I was like, okay, I'm using Vicki Booten. I'm going to use those. I know, I just got them a couple of months ago and I'm going to actually use some. That's crazy. But they're really good to layer behind, which is what the sketch calls for. So I went through the four and this one has a title that I want to use, which is Oh So Good. So that's going to be my title. So this is going to be the ephemera pack that I used. Now, my videos have been kind of shorter lately because I've done a lot of work ahead of time. This one might not be, I'm warning you now, because I know that looks like a lot of work ahead of time, but it's gonna take me a while to uh, go through my paper packs. So in the sketch, or not my paper packs, my ephemera pack, they have one picture and it's been layered like four times. So what I did is I went through my rainbow color scraps. I have them divided by rainbow order. I have them separated between pattern paper and cardstock paper, and then they're in iris bins. And I picked out an orange, a green, a yellow, and a blue that match my circles. And I layered my, my photo four times. So we are ready now to get busy. 
Now I do say see that they have some splattering. I think I will go ahead and wait until after I get it done. Sometimes I do it ahead of time, but to tell you the truth, I don't want to wait on it to dry. So we know we need this. I'm going to put it up here like so. Okay guys, sorry about that. <clears throat> I got interrupted. So my sketch, and this is what I have so far. I'm gonna put my photo here. I'm gonna put my adults only here. And then we are going to layer up some ephemera. So let me go ahead and do that. This, mine's going to be a little further to the right than the sketch, just so I have room for my, my little thing. I finally got the Nuvo gun. I probably have showed you that already, but whoo, it's awesome. I love it. It's so much easier. You can, especially for this series, I'm sure it's going to be a lifesaver. I have tried many different ways to glue these down and I bought the little uh, like stick things. You wanna know what I'm talking about? I'll show you in just a second. And those did not work at all. So then I was like, okay, well. <laughs> and then just using regular glue is kind of difficult because you get too much and all that so this is going to be a lifesaver now you're gonna see me do a lot of different things with these cut files I have some cool ideas and I'll show you some of them but I figured just spraying one was not going to be that exciting so I did that off camera Oops, let's get it going the right direction. So I'm gonna put this right here, okay? And then this came in a little baggie separate. So make sure you get all the pieces. Sorry, not a whole lot to say while I'm pulling this down. There we go. I am about out of Heidi Swap Color Shine in the Black. So I've got to find, I don't even know if you can buy that anymore. If not, I really need to find another black spray. Because I love it. All right. Adults only. Okay. There's that. This is what I was talking about that I have. And I've tried to use this Crafter's Companion. It, my, um... Whatchamacallit, so it would never stick down with that. Okay, let me wipe off my hands because they've got black and I've already got enough black on my layout on accident. So, oh, and in case, I mean, you need to know or want to know, I have a box, a 12 by 12 box that I just, when I'm spraying like that, because I know it's going to go everywhere, and I just put it in a box and just spray it, and then I just set that box aside and, um, let it dry. All right, so let's go through the ephemera and see what all I might want. Okay, we have some flowers. I don't need the paintbrush. I don't need anything artsy. I could use yes, please. That would be cute. Okay, I don't know if I'm going to use the flowers or not. Definitely not the birds. If you've been around for very long, Friends, family, good times. That would be good, but I don't have a picture. 
today was a perfect day. A little tab, that would work. Lots of artsy stuff, moment of a lifetime. Okay, so that's the front part. I haven't even looked at this. All this happiness, happy day, love it. Here's the whole story. Oh, these are like little paperclip looking things. Doing your thing. My favorite snapshots of your life, of our life. There's another flower, but love, love, love this life. Some more binder clips. Wow. Or mom, depending on which way you want to put it. <laughs> Some more tabs. Currently a butterfly, sunglasses. Too bad that sunglasses aren't green because um, that would go perfect for Wicked. An alligator clip, a butterfly, some more tabs, and this. Okay, so let me put these back up. I pulled out the ones that, and I might, I mean, I think flowers would be okay, don't you? If I use the flowers. Yeah, thanks. Glad you agree with me. <laughs> or if you say no. Oh, sorry. That's probably what I'm going to do, though. Let me see if I can put these back in here in some kind of order. Now, I have to say, sometimes these cut files really make me think outside the box. And a lot of times that's why I don't do all 31 is I think and think and think and I'm like, I just cannot figure out something to use with that cut file. So they go in a big iris container that's full of cut files that, yeah, I'll use someday. I keep telling myself. Okay, so there's that set. So let's pull out this set now. Some more flowers, a big camera all the things, another flower. I kind of like, I like this, but I don't, I'm not gonna use it. Although I do like this one, I might use that one. Camera, I can do all things, more flowers. Am I gonna use all these flowers? Probably not, but I've got them. So I have a variety. Uh, create yourself, live in the moment, that's what I'm saying, live colorfully, and then on the other side we have that, oh, a little heart, that's cute, amazing, happy, beautiful, some vellum color wheels, memories, and some uh, swishes of color, swatches of color. I don't know what you would want to call them. Okay, so let's put, oh, and then we have some more vellum up here. Let's put all these back. Does anyone else love going through ephemera packs? <laughs> Just me? I love them. sometimes they can really spark. Oh, I think I'll do use that or look at that. Okay, now I need the titles, which is over here. Let's just see what all's in this because I have not looked through these at all. Okay, there's the titles. I know I need that. Oh, and then there's like some washi. Oh, some color splashes. I think I'll keep that one out. Lots of wordy bits. And then on the other side, there's some more. Oh, those are cool too. That's neat. Yes, I like those a lot. Okay. I've got to remember just to pull these out every now and then. But yeah, I'm trying to get a little bit ahead because school's going to start soon. <laughs> yeah. And yeah, a whole bunch of stuff like that. Okay, so 
I have the flowers. I have this. I'm actually going to cut this in half. Or kind of half. Half-ish. I'm going to put one over here. And to put this yes please on. And I think I'm going to put one. I don't know if I can fit it under that though. That's okay. One more down. So I'll put this one up a little bit more. There we go. And then this one. Uh, I can't because that glue is gluing. That's okay. I'm just going to put like this and then I'll cover up that that sticks out a little bit. Okay, so there's that. All right. I also want... I think I'm going to use this green just because it's the smallest. And I'm going to put it under here. Like that. Okay. I do like that. So note to self, layer before you glue your thing down. <laughs> See, now I... I, I figured that out. Okay, so where they have their, this technically is kind of my title, but I think I'm going to put oh so good like down here. So let me do that. That's kind of where their title is. Now the only thing about this that I don't like are these stickers here are very thin. So they will break easily and I'm usually pretty good about doing that. So, so I'm going to put the good here. Okay. And then I don't know if you'll be able to see this, so if I put it on the picture, so I'm going to put it, I think I'll put it here and then put the O above it or put it here. Yeah, I like that. Oh, see? Told you they were kind of thin. And then put the O up here. So be very careful with these. That's my tip for the day. Now I'm going to tuck in some flowers here and there. Those are really big. I don't know if I'll use these great big ones just because I don't have a whole lot of room. I guess I could put that one down there like that. Okay. Kind of covers up the stem, but that's all right. And I could do... I purposely left this O kind of loose so that I can tuck underneath it, like so. Tuck that flower there, and that one like that. I want to make sure you can still read the adults only. Okay, like that. And another one up here, like so. And I think that's going to be it. Oh, I don't like where that O ended up, just because it's touching the so, and that kind of bothers me. So I'm going to take this O up and rip it. <laughs> that's my fault for being stupid. Okay, I'm going to glue these things down. Now I'm going to put, I want the O starting about here instead of so close to the so. Okay. 
Okay. Yeah, I like that better. Okay, let's glue this stuff down. I would really kind of like something up there, but those flowers are just so big. There were some smaller ones I could get. Um, I think it was in this one. Oh, no, I don't remember. I have a song stuck in my head. I can't remember. If it, I think it was these. Okay. Yeah, I see them. A bunch of different colored ones. Yep, like that. There we go. I like that. So let me glue these down. And then glue this one down. Okay, bring these up just a little bit. And over a little bit. There we go. Okay. Now let me turn this. Oh, I got a, dropped a heart. Put this down and that down and that down. And then put this like so. Yes, please. Okay, and then I think I'm gonna take my black splatter. Yep, it's getting so low, Eek. Cover this a little bit. Oh, let me stamp my date really quick. And yes, I do have black fingerprints all over this. That's just the way it's gonna be this time. And that is going to be it for day one of 31 days of cut files. And I pretty sure I you will see me tomorrow for day two. So until then, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more, hit that subscribe button down below. Go see everyone else. I will. I don't know that there's a playlist. I need to go find that out. Um, but if there is a playlist, I'll leave it down below. I will link Janet Fritz and um, MK Gun, although I'm sure you already have their channels. But I will put them down below. And thank you so much for joining me. See you next time. Bye, guys.